the outfield, all right, and you're around the base. And there's a lot of controversy on this, so I'm just going to tell you what I'm going to teach you. It's that the other base that I've uh, seen a lot of my high school coach, my college coach, talk to us about, you know, bananaing out like this, okay, and then, you know, get the banana, I don't know, there's so much literature on you got to hit the corner of the bag. Okay, that's, that's for sure. you got to hit this corner. Okay, right there. Okay, you don't want to hit any other corner about that. But there's all this literature that says you got to hit with your left foot. You got to hit with your right foot. I couldn't care less what foot you hit. Alright, I, mean, I try to teach it, and what ends up happening is, and I think you need to look, technically you need to hit it with your outside leg. I try to teach that, and then what's up happening is that, okay, guys, I need everyone to hit the, hit the bag with their left foot. Train up one. Okay? And they're slowing themselves down. All right? When it becomes really confusing, just have them hit the corner of the base. Make it easy on yourself. At the high school level, that's all we teach. All right? I, I really care less. All right? Technically, yes, it's both the problem hit with the left foot. Um, we'll probably put this up on YouTube. Someone will say, hey, play baseball, hey, we're dealing with youth baseball. All right. Secondly is, you don't have to banana out so much. Okay. It takes, again, going back to the old adage, put it way to get from point A to point B in a straight line. All right. You really don't have to go way out here. All right. Rosine taught me this, but I used to teach that until I kind of picked a brain about it. Just think about dropping your inside shoulder. Okay, so I get here, right, I don't need to banana out that far, but I'm just going to drop my inside shoulder. And that gets me on the path, right to second base. Because the idea is, is that if you hit the ball in the outfield, you're looking to take second base. The worst thing you can do, is if you're out like this, and I keep my shoulders level, I'm out here. So now I'm going more circular. And it goes back to that whole straight line idea. So you really want to, the easiest way to teach rounding the base is let's minimize the banana. You don't have to banana all the way out. And if you just have your kids drop the inside shoulder and have them exaggerate that, I'm well on my way. Drop the inside shoulder. It's a lot easier. Drop the inside shoulder. And again, I'm just trying to hit that corner of the base and go. 